It was really jarring to see Kamala Harris standing next to Liz Cheney and thanking Liz Cheney for her father, Dick Cheney's service to our country. Now, I don't know if you know or remember that Dick Cheney was one of the worst vice presidents we ever had in the United States, largely responsible for the U.S. invading Iraq on the basis of lies because there were no weapons of mass destruction. And with that invasion, it led to the death of hundreds of thousands of Iraqis, almost 5,000 Americans, over a trillion dollars of our money. And what worse could a country do than invade another country on the basis of lies? And not only that, Dick Cheney is responsible for what he called enhanced interrogation, which means torture. He also was a proponent of unwarranted surveillance of us, the American people. Well, I guess it's not all that strange that Kamala Harris would be thanking a war criminal because she's in the administration that has been supporting, partnering with Israel during this entire year of genocide. But what does it say about our country that war criminals are rewarded instead of taken to The Hague?